Hi. I am here with peace and light, and I mean no harm to you. Today, I would like to communicate with Lord Lucan. Did he really kill himself by jumping out of a boat in English Channel with a stone tied to his body? Did he really kill his children's nanny? Did he think he, uh, she was his wife? Well, once he was considered for the role of James Bond, is it because he was the real deal living James Bond? <laughs> If he is still alive today, did he get help from higher up such as secret services to get a new ID and escape the country? What is the reason behind Lady Lucan leaving all her inheritance to homeless charities instead of her children? Was he really a professional gambler? Was he really a banker or uh, being a banker it was his cover-up? Was he a spy? Did he escape to Switzerland and murdered there? Did he move to South Africa and start a new family and life there? You see in Australia now. Does the members of the Claremont set at the Claremont Club, the basement of famous Annabelle's club, knew what happened to him? Some of the members were society figures who frequented the club, included Peter Sellers, Ian Fleming, Lucian Freud, Lord Lucan, Lord Darby, Lord Woodby, the Duke of Devonshire, James Goldsmith, Gianni Angeli. Jim Slater. That's a big list. If he escaped a new life, who helped him? Yeah. So I
His daughter, Lady Camilla, was appointed as Queen's Council in 2013. What's your thoughts on that? Will we ever know the mystery behind Lord Lupin? Thank you ever so much for communicating. You can go back to light. Bye bye.